What's up guys, Eternal here and today I'm gonna show you how to play Jinx. I'll be playing with Lulu against Lux and Jin. Let's go with Dance Blade. And Q Ferris and I'll be playing with the best build and runes for season 12 Jinx. So taking a look, there's little tempo. It's great because the most important stat as Jinx is attack speed. Then you gain additional range and Jinx gets additional range on her Q, which is Rocket Launcher, you can switch that with the Q. And in that mode, you deal damage to subsequent targets as well, but your basic attacks cost mana, your odds attack range is increased. You can press A key to see the range. Usually you wanna fight in close range using minigun, which has shorter range but greater attack speed. As for your passive, whenever a champion, epic jungle, monster or structure that Jinx has dealt damage to within the last 3 seconds is killed or destroyed, she gains decaying movement speed. So it's an initial burst of movement speed, which rapidly decays after a while. It's usually good because it helps you on your killing spree, like after getting a single kill, you're able to catch up to another target with the movement speed. It's for later, especially. Other than that, when pushing. Okay, so you just wanna switch the range as you can see. I keep switching. I use minigun, which costs nothing. So, last hit. Oh, could have kept my W for longer. Yeah. Alice was visible anyway, so without the W applied, this gank couldn't work. Now there's W, it deals physical damage, but it collides with the first target hit, so you have to get rid of minions first if you wanna apply that W onto the enemy. It also slows, and it casts faster based on attack speed, so the more attack speed you have, the faster it goes. I mean the cast time, not the projectile speed itself. Usually it's better when you push as Jinx and not being the one who is being pushed because you're not able to abuse your range, like make use of that. Okay. This is good, he had to flash. Then there is your E. It rules the target in one place for 1.5 seconds and you can use it defensively or aggressively. So you use it aggressively to follow up CC. Let's say that in our team there is Elise and she applies the stun. Then in that place where your enemy is stunned, you can just put E and after the CC ends, your root will apply, keeping your enemy in one place for a long time. Ensures that you can get the kill. And as for other aggressive option, sometimes you can just place E behind your enemy. Like when going for an aggressive engage on bot lane. Sometimes your enemy can accidentally step on that. And as for defensive options, you just escape and put your E behind yourself to cut off the path for your enemy. You wanna max Q first. Nice switch like this. Okay. There's no point overextending and Jinx is a kind of a late game champion, but it doesn't mean that her early game should be passive. You can get kills, it depends on the type of support you have in terms of a champion. So when you play with something like Lona or Nautilus, you'll have more chances for some aggressive engages and then you're more likely to get a kill. But I recommend playing with Lulu because in the long run it's really worth it, like later you gain constant movement speed, you also 
more likely to survive. Oh. I don't see the enemy. Yeah. Nothing can be done at this point. Okay, I've got CS lead. I was thinking if I should E, but actually no, she wasn't close enough. So it would be a waste of mana. Newly doubled his CS. And as for mythic item options, most of the times you wanna go Gale Force. It grants you a dash. And it's pretty useful for a champion without the dash. You can use it aggressively too. And then use your superior range. No. He's level 5, not 6. I mean, Yone, so. Okay. Oh, I'm one. Whoa. Chill. Seriously? I wanted to say that I was one minion away from my ult. Okay, so boots first. Oh, they have tons of healing, so I'm gonna buy this and let's try. And with your ult, now you can pay attention to the map and try to snipe the enemy. I want out because Mundo is a free kill, so why would I steal? My ult wouldn't be enough to finish the target off, so I didn't commit. But ult deals more damage based on the target's missing health, so when your target is on lower HP, you're more likely to finish off the target. Lux back. I was checking the top lane if I could out someone, but no. I'm trying to care. I just 
not with such health. You wanna push this quickly? Because there's a least so let's see why. <laughs> Where is this fiesta? W max second, okay. I'm not able to reach them. Karina, okay, let's just see like this. Slightly harder. Oh, she's not able to get the kill. She's not. But it forces me to back. Does it? I'm gonna stay. And I'm also staying because Karina decided to go mid. And my allies are close enough. I could save my mana for my ult. Who knows? I'm not gonna W. Okay. This one has ult, I think. Six kills Karina, okay. Yeah, this time I had to back, sadly. Even with Karina mid. So close. You're my favorite waste of hope. Aren't they? Twenty HP. Twenty HP, guys. So this is an example of an aggressive cast. Double kill. 
see no need to order something if you can just have your little temple stacked and you have the range you use rocket launcher it's all right oh also you gain attack speed on the passive that's also important see how fast she's able to kite <laughs> Calculated. Okay, I see that. <laughs> okay, that was good, I think. I outplayed. I was waiting for that moment, really focused on the moment where she would kill. Glad it worked, it looked nice. We are not showing up on bot lane yet. Now we did. Okay, I have the movement speed soon from my passive, see that? Oh. oh, I was so close to block that and I just got my active. Maybe if I didn't out, I wouldn't stay in one place, so I would then press active and heal. Who knows, but I think it was worth trying because if I manage to ult, I would get movement speed from the passive, so that's a lot, I would say. Okay, selling this to finish the item that makes an impact. Look at my range now, and imagine with little tempo even greater. So it's currently... 875. It's for the next basic attack, of course, and then it has to load. But it's too lot. Oh. I don't see the place where she's recalling. Is it there? Oh. Now oh, he's not able to outplay me. <laughs> mm, I kind of overstayed. Once more, I counted on my passive instead of just going back.
Just check Baron. Okay. We can still win. I can shut down this Karina. You shouldn't chase Mundo that much. It's a bad idea. Oh. <laughs> Guys, that was a bronze bait, seriously. It's not easy. Yeah, Mundo is zoning me, you know? I can't go this way. Okay. Since Karina is coming, we won't commit. Baron. Maybe a trap. Now we'll go for the Drake at this point. We rush this or we trap. No. No. Just how team based this game is. Oh, I got spotted. I might die. Yeah, probably dead. Or actually safe. I heal. Oh, it was a bite. You're starting to bore. An enemy has been slain. No, not Lux now. I'm trying to care. 
I'm gonna let him recall. Okay, rush, rush. Okay, stop it. Okay. Never mind. So close. Let's just behave. Said no one ever. Okay, good core items. Um, actually, we have to defend this. Look, <laughs> the damage. Now it's all about the position. Oh. I wish I flashed. I was like seeing Karina just assaulting me, so I thought maybe I can survive. Actually not. It's not over yet, come on. Okay, we have to leave this Drake. Penta. Ah, oh. it's so good, it's so good. Alice, okay. Okay, nothing more can be done.
I'm going for this since they have Mundo and Karina has more HP than me anyway, so it's worth it. He's split pushing. Your turret has been destroyed. Your turret has been destroyed. Sir, always ready to cry. <laughs> wait, 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 don't. But look, they did one, three, one, so I couldn't answer. Okay. We have all the inhibitors. I'm doing something risky, maybe it can work. Okay, go back, go back, go back. Um, somehow you're still staying? The plan is only good if you manage to back instantly. Not like that. Okay. He only went for the Drake, right? Got him. Whoops. Okay, what is this champion? You think I'm crazy? You should be Okay. We push bot now. Don't face check and it should be good. Don't face check, don't you're staying close to the wall. It's obvious for Karina to be there. She might not be there, but just don't give the chance like that. No face checks. Okay, she's mid, now we know. Okay, there is Kari now. And we siege them, we siege them now. Nice. 
Ven, sí, sí. Won't be a pen to sudden. But what a game, guys. See? Never surrender. Okay, GG. Thanks for watching. And if you enjoyed, please leave a like and subscribe. And you can check out my other videos and stream. See you next time.